of school, work, or extracurricular activities, students have a hard time finding enough time to sleep. However, according to a study by the UC Berkeley Psychology Department, students should develop better sleeping habits in order to prevent negative effects on their cognitive abilities. In this study, researchers had 18 young adults aged in their 20s and 15 older adults aged in their 70s test their abilities to remember 120 word sets after a night's worth of sleep. Bryce Mander, the main conductor of the experiment, found that the quality of sleep among older people was 75% lower than those of younger people. We find also that their ability to remember uh, what they had studied the night before was 55% lower as compared to young adults. So they're showing pretty big impairments in their memory and pretty big changes in their deep sleep physiology. And it turns out in this study we found that they were actually related to each other. So the, the, the shorter that wave was, the more of a drop in their memory there was. Some of the reasons why Mander believes that older adults have sleep disruptions are both disorders and changes in their sleeping patterns. And, uh, there's other factors, like maybe you'll have a disorder or another health problem makes you get up and go to the bathroom a lot of times at night, or you may develop a sleep disorder. Those are other factors that can affect sleep in older people. Even though the study found that sleep amongst older adults was worse than those of younger adults, Mander believes that students need to develop better sleeping habits so that they can improve their memory before exams. Say you're a student and you have a test the next day, right? A very common thing that people will do is either study in the morning before the test or they'll pull an all-nighter. Mm -hmm. And maybe they'll be lucky enough if the test is earlier in the day or in the afternoon that they'll remember the material they studied when they did the all-nighter. But test them a month later, test them a week later, they won't remember anything. If they had to taste, take that test again, they'd probably fail it. However, if they studied and then slept on their information, and they do it repeatedly over the course of their semester, they'll be much more likely to remember what they're studying and remember what they're learning. Because of the results of this project, students might want to think twice before pulling an all-nighter or staying up late on a weeknight. For Cal TV News in Berkeley, this is Anna Carlos. Thank you.